Hello and welcome to What Jalairs. Today I have a wantable. This is the Every Woman Edit. This is a style edit. And as you know, if you've been watching my last several wantable videos, I have not been having the best luck with them, especially with their themed edits. But I'm very hopeful still. I like to give them a chance. I think that I have had a lot of success with them in the past. And I like what they have, like they have a stream that you can look at and it will um, have some of the items that you can get in your box and you can like them or do a little heart next to them. So they will include some of those items in your box, which is great. I think it helps to get to know your style. Okay, looks uh, very neutral. All right, let's see what they have to say. Hi Jill, you are strong and beautiful. Wear looks that make you feel confident and you are unstoppable. I hope you love the seven pieces I chose for you from our Every Woman Edit. And you embrace these spring looks and yourself with joy and confidence. I included pieces that are unique, yet versatile and can be dressed up or down. Try the Rachel Jeans Sonoma Tee and sweater jacket together for a chic look. I hope you find that these pieces make you feel like the best version of yourself. Once you've tried everything on, you get five days. Be sure to let me know what you think. Tip, if you get your, oh, you get your $20 styling fee credited back, so buy one item and it's like getting styled for free. Have a beautiful March, my friend. Enjoy, Liliana. I mean, I've been doing these for years, Liliana, so I do know that. <laughs> she probably just adds that as her little spiel. Um, let's see. So what I had asked for was hoping for some long and short sleeve blouses that are ran or cotton, please no 100% poly, a light colored flare or boot cut jean, and a 27, 20 inch inseam, a black moto jacket. Okay. Oh, and this was a $10 styling fee instead of a $20 styling fee. So that was even incorrect on her thing because it was $10 this time. I think it was like a little dealy that they had had. Okay, so first it looks like we have some jewelry or some sort of accessory. Oh yes, I think I requested these. They are some very cute earrings. So I loved kind of the boho. They're gonna look really good actually with this outfit I have on right now. This is the little kimono I kept from my Transcend. Um, but these are super duper cute, very lightweight, which is great. And they're like beaded, so cute. Okay, next we have the Rachel Jean. So if you watch my Transcend, I think that was my last video, you know that I got the Rachel Jean in that, but these are a different wash, it looks like, a different cut, or not cut, but um, there's different elements to them. So I did not keep those. I'm kind of glad because I'm kind of liking these already because they have a chewed or cut off hem. So really already liking Okay, a little hole there, not sure about that one, but really like this bottom part a lot. So we'll see what these ones look like on. I'm sure they're gonna look very similar, especially in the cut, but the wash and everything is gonna look a little bit different. These are really cute. I really like all that distressing. It's just minimal, but it's enough to like give it a little interest. Okay, next we have some Jag jean shorts. They are black. They are a mid-rise boyfriend short with a five inch inseam. It says the best kept secret. So I'm excited actually to try these because I like a good little boyfriend cut. And I, I think, oh no, they have elastic on the inside of the waistband. I've had problem with having elastic on the inside of the waistband before as I 
am allergic to a lot of things and I broke out from it. So I'm a little nervous about that, but we'll try mine. See if we get irritated. <laughs> All right, next is a little dress by Coin1804 Los Angeles. So cute. This is really cute for summer. I love, love this little tie right here. And the pattern is really cute. Looks like a high-low, so a little higher in the front, longer in the back. And yeah, this is super cute. It has blues, blacks, and like a cream color in it. I really love that tie right there though. That is so, so cute. Next is a top by 78 and Sunny. This is a t-shirt. Just a white t-shirt. It's kind of um, slouchy feeling, which I love. 50% modal and 50% cotton. Really like that. Actually, I want to check the fabric on this dress. Ninety five percent rayon and five percent spandex. It's very soft and stretchy feeling. Okay, next we have a top by Week and very cute. This is a black color and it has green little rose looking flowers on it and a ruffle at the bottom and this one's 100% polyester so that's disappointing because I told her no 100% polyester but we'll try it on and lastly very interesting I asked for this coat again like months ago because it is a little more heavy weight but since then I had gotten a stitch fix coat again that I absolutely loved and I kept. So I'm kind of glad that I'm getting this now and not back then because I maybe would have kept this one. And now that I have it, I am really happy that I kept the other one because this one feels a little acrylic-y. It's by Saltwater Lux, designed in Los Angeles. So there it is. Pockets in the front, but yeah, it's very like heavy. And let's look at the fabric. Yeah, it's 70% acrylic, 27% nylon, and 3% spandex. So I am really happy I got that other one. Actually, it's right here. This is the Market and Spruce Note 41 Hawthorne one I got from my Stitch Fix and I absolutely love it. It is like a sweatshirt material, perfect for the weather that's right now. And I've worn it so many times. I love it so much. I'm so glad I kept it. Um, I think this coat's on sale though. So we'll try it on and see. I'm sure it's gonna look super cute because I really love that other one. That style is like, I'm really loving it. And you know what? It's like 75 degrees out today. It is um, Michigan. And Michigan in March typically is still freezing cold, sometimes snowing. We just got like a big dump uh, of snow last week. So yeah, it's so unpredictable. <laughs> but we are welcoming it, especially with a puppy. We can get her out and running and doing all the puppy things. So okay, let's do a try on. I'm excited. Before I try the clothes on, I just thought I'd throw this earring on. This is by Ink and Alloy, and it is the Diamond Fringe Earrings in Rust Gray Ivory, which are the colors I've been loving lately, my bracelets. And they are $44. I think they are a really good size and I really like them. Cute. 
first outfit. So I am so, so glad that I got that other jacket first. I don't even think I would have kept this one. It just, it's too big. It's too itchy. It's too oversized. It looks a little sloppy to me. My other one has pockets that go like this. This one has pockets that go like this. So yeah, I can't wait to get this one off. I'm really, really, really happy with my choice. Cause I wanted this one. I'd asked for it specifically. I did not know that there was acrylic in it, but yeah. Okay, and I'm really, really happy that I got these jeans as well because I liked the other ones, but I really like these. And then here's that t-shirt too. So this is a very Jill outfit, just very simple, casual, chill, chill vibes. Love how the sleeves come down a little bit lower a little string there so they don't have that weird triangle effect so that's good everyone can use a good white t-shirt so this could be a nice basic staple and then here are the jeans so so cute love the bottoms I do wish they were maybe a smidge longer, but I do think with it being a little bit warmer coming up that these would be a great spring summer option for jean because of where they hit. Cause you can wear sandals, little flats like this with it. And they're just a nice like um, relaxed fit jean. This t-shirt does have a slight rounded hem. Really nice, like it. All right, next I have the jean shorts and this little polyester top. And I kind of like this too. <laughs> These jean shorts are really great in the fact that they're a little big, a little slouchy. You can wear them dressed up or dressed down. I love the length of them. You could really wear a nice dressed up top with heels like I have on now and go out for a little date. You could also wear it with a t-shirt and it'd be super cute that way. So they are not sewn up, so you could wear them down. They are in mid-rise. Really cute. And then we have this polyester top and I do kind of like it. It fits really, really good. Under the arms, good. I don't think it looks too boxy or wide because it is a little high-low with the ruffle. I think that's really cute. Put a little necklace on with it. Actually, let me go get one. You can't see it that much, but little necklace. You could put a little you know, a little suit jacket. Super cute. This is actually from Wantable from years ago. I got two of them. One is this black and one is a teal. It is the dupe to the BCBG, very expensive tuxedo type suit jacket. And I love them. Really cute. All right, lastly, we have this dress. I decided to put my little, little hat on with it. And it has like a cruise vibes or vacation vibes to it with the pattern. And I think this is really nice. It's a pretty good silhouette, I feel like, for me. Um, 
with the bigger pattern, the darker background, I think it looks nice. I don't think it makes me look pregnant or too, too busty. Uh, I just like to not accentuate that area. The v-neck is really nice. Love this little tie. So cute. And the little flutter sleeves are really cute. You could probably wear a belt with it. I like how you can't see so much this like lighter. I don't like when it's unfinished underneath, but this one you can't tell so much. So it doesn't bother me. It's very cute though. It's very flowy. I forgot to do pricing on everything as I went. I was going to, and then I forgot. So let's do a recap and talk about pricing. Pretty good box. Sorry I forgot to do the pricing as I went. I was going to because I've, I've had requests for that, and I forgot. <laughs> I started that out with the earrings, and then I forgot. Okay, so the earrings were 44 The white tee was... 46 that's called the Sonoma v-neck slinky tee in optic white the sleeveless floral peplum top in black green by week and 54 the long sleeve sweater jacket in sienna by saltwater Lux 54 that's on sale normally 108 the short sleeve high low leaf print dress in charcoal by coin 1804 78 the alex boyfriend short in black jag jeans 58 the Rachel High Rise Mom Jean and Poised Cut from the Cloth, 92. 426 is the total. If you keep uh, five or more, you get 20% off. So that would be 85.20 if I kept everything. And then you take off the $10 styling fee. So, and add tax. So yeah, not too bad. 3, 30, 80 plus tax not going to keep the jacket that's going to go back for sure I could keep everything else though I mean this is a good box um I'm thinking if I just keep four it might end up being maybe these four or maybe the earrings minus one of these even though that top was polyester I did kind of like it but I don't know. Maybe I'll try that out with jeans and see what I think of that. I could probably do without the dress, I think, even though I do like it. Tell me your favorites. I don't want to keep everything as I want to save my budget for other boxes, but that was a really good box, so I could keep a lot. It's been a while since I've had a really good wantable box, so thank you, Liliana. Great job. Thanks everyone for watching so much. I am just so happy that you come to my channel again and again and watch my videos. It keeps things going and I like doing them. So I want to keep doing them and I can only do that if you keep watching me. So thanks again and we will see you in the next video.